If you look at the moon tonight, okay, just up and to the right of it, do you see that dot? Looks like a star. That's Jupiter. And the skies have finally cleared here tonight. So do you want to go see it through a large telescope? Yeah? All right, let's go. Let's start with the moon. Hey, hey really bright. Let's dim this way down. Hi, Luna. This is the waning Gibbous moon. Let's zoom in on that Terminator line where the light meets the dark. That's what it's called, the Terminator line. You can see so many shadows of the craters. It's just incredible the details you can pick out. How far can we zoom in? Whoa, look at the atmospheric disturbance. All that wobbling, just crazy. I'm gonna rotate this for a screenshot. All right, there's a nice screenshot for you guys. Now, let's go to Jupiter before some clouds come take it away. There's Jupiter and we can see three of the four Galilean moons, but Callisto is actually transiting the planet tonight. Let's zoom in, see if we can possibly see the shadow. All right, let's dim this down. Oh, I don't know if I see the shadow, but hey, Jupiter. Oh, I, I do, I see the shadow down there and to the right, it's so wobbly. It's a little bit windy, but do you see the shadow? That is so cool. That's Callisto's shadow. I didn't think we'd see it, but we did. Jupiter and Callisto's moon shadow. I'm glad I came out when I did because now the clouds are here for a little bit, but I did happen to capture Comet 3i Atlas last night. I'm gonna put that on the screen for you right here at the end of the video. But if you get the chance, you even got a little bit of clear skies. Go out, check out Jupiter next to the moon tonight, all right? See you soon.